you know, when you're hitting a couple of thousand dollars a day, what's your main way of keeping track of your finances every single day? Because I've really been struggling. I've been going through all my Shopify statements and everything and my advertisement payments. And it sort of seems to take a lot out of my day trying to organize money um, and it's confusing me a lot. So I wanted to know like what your main strategy is of organizing all your finances on a daily basis. Got it. So one, you want to use Autometrics. Um, Autometrics will tell you if you're profitable or not. And that will sort of give you the peace of mind if you're not losing money. Two, you want to go ahead and use apps like DSs where you could combine a bunch of your order fulfillments and basically instead of doing 30 $30 transactions, you just have one $900 transactions for all your orders. And three, you definitely want to use the tracking finance sheet, which I provide in the business program. Basically, it helps you track all your finances. You know your weekly balance, you know your monthly balance, and it allows you to track everything. And that's in the business program. So those are the three tips when it comes to um, tracking your finances. Yeah, okay, great. Because when I'm trying to do it manually, just through like my Shopify and Facebook ads, every time I add it all up, there seems to be like this one chunk of money missing and I'm not sure what's happened to that. I don't know whether that's to do with like a payment processor um, with Stripe or something. I can't get in touch with them, but there is a large sum of money missing from my payouts. Have you ever dealt with that? Got it. So usually people that don't do their accounting, if they don't follow the accounting module properly, they always forget something. They either forget PayPal or they forget Stripe or they forget um, certain fees because if you sort of add up everything, it should add up. And sometimes people double add. If you use a credit card, they sort of mix up the transaction from your bank account with the credit card statement and everything just jumbles up. And that's why the accounting module is super important. Um, so I think one, you just have to make sure you make things as simple as possible. Two, when you go ahead and join the business program, I'll help you organize all your accounting as well. Um, and three, focus on just looking at auto metrics, seeing if you're profitable. And if you're profitable, you're good to go. And then wait until you have expert help when it comes to just organizing all your finance. 